here is my lagoon and uh, we're gonna test the theory today let's see if I can't get a 40 taper a cat 40 taper to fit in this machine like I said it came stock with the NMTB and uh, here is our 40 taper tool holder here and I've already removed one of the drive dogs here it is you can see how uh, beefy that is that's a lot better than a dinky little pin holding your R8 and not only do you got one of these but you have two and I'll show you underneath the cavity uh, you can see where the dogs go I've got one dog removed and one uh, still intact and right in the center is my draw bar there All right, so let's install this thing and see if it fits. Remember, we gotta get the drive dog on the right side because uh, one doesn't fit. All right, I have it installed. Let's take a look. You can see how the double collar hangs down. I've got one drive dog uh, engaged. The other one is not engaged. And it fits very nicely. Let's turn it on. All right, spinning true, no problems. Okay, let's cut some chips and do the final test to make sure uh, this thing works.
Well, there you go. I'd say the uh, Cat 40 tooling was a success. To give you a good look at it, you can see the uh, drive dog missing. Uh, we got this drive dog engaged. You can see the double collar. And uh, up top, I have my adjustable drawbar. Right there. There it is. That's the Cat 40. And uh, I'm pretty happy. Uh, down here you can see uh, some of my tooling. It's all Cat 40. And uh, I have proven that the Cat 40 tool holders will work in the Lagoon. And they will replace the NMTB 40 taper tool holders. So uh, not only can I use this for my manual machine, one of these days when I grow up to be a big boy and get some CNC machinery, I'll have tooling that is compatible with my CNC and with my manual machine.